5 Top Dividend Stocks to Buy Hello and welcome to our channel Pursuit of Wealth. This channel is your ultimate destination for learning about finance and wealth, investing and crypto, informational and educational trends in finance management. If you are someone who wishes to become wealthy and looking for smart money management options, then we are fortunate to have found each other. Investing in stocks isn't everybody's cup of tea. As an investor in stocks, you need to consider the losses you'll face once you invest your money. This is because investing in stocks doesn't come without failure. Investing in stocks doesn't mean investing your money in a brainless manner. There are different kinds of stocks you can invest your money in. Today, we shall be looking at one such type of stock. The stock we shall be looking into is dividend stocks. And before we discuss which dividend stocks you need to invest your money in, let us first discuss what they are. A dividend stock is the distribution of a company's earnings to significant shareholders. The company's directors decide the people who have the major stocks. A dividend stock can be paid to the shareholder in cash or additional stocks. The received profits are divided amongst the people, which is how people get to make money on dividend stocks. The main player that comes here is voting rights. These dividends are approved by shareholders using voting rights. As mentioned, usually dividends are given in the form of cash. The company's net profits make up the dividends given to shareholders. A significant chunk of the profit is kept by the shareholders, however. Dividends are also paid to the shareholders even if the company doesn't make suitable profits. This is to maintain their track of dividend payments made. As long as this track record is clear, it gives shareholders the confidence that the company will be making payments shortly. What companies pay dividends? Dividends are paid by more established companies that have their profits fixed. This is so because these companies have predictable trends and are likely to make profits. These companies issue regular dividends because they look to maximize the shareholder's wealth apart from the normal wealth growing process. There are several companies present in different sectors that record regular dividend payments. These include utility, oil and gas, banks, and healthcare. Since these companies have large chunks of profits coming in, giving off dividends makes a lot of sense. Furthermore, dividend payments have a positive reflection on a company, which helps them build good relations with their investors. If dividend payments are regularly made, there is better trust between the company and its investors. Shareholders also prefer dividends because, in many countries, dividends are treated as an income free of taxes. Since there are no tax deductions on the money, many investors prefer being paid in dividends. Paying no tax is the most prominent reason investors opt for being paid by dividends. Now that we've discussed all the basics about dividends, it is time to step into something a little more complicated. We will talk about the top 5 dividend stocks in which you should invest your money. Without further ado, let us begin. Annaly Capital Management Inc. NLY. One of the world's largest mortgage real estate investment trusts, NLY, is based in Maryland, with its major office present in New York City. Annaly Capital has managed to deliver such consistent performance in its 24 years of existence because the company borrows the money using repurchase agreements and then invests this money in asset backed securities. These securities include residential and commercial assets such as real estate and middle market lending. On December 9th, Annaly Capital announced a fourth quarter dividend of 22 cents per common share. The payable date for this dividend is January 31st, 2022. The last dividend date that passed by was December 30th, 2021. With a staggering market cap of $11.9 billion, the one-year total return for NLY dividends will be 10.5%. The forward dividend yield is 10.69% with a payout ratio of 47.6%. On the Fortune 500, this company is ranked 910th. Even after being a company known as one in which one should invest dividend stocks, NLY's dividend has not been stable over the last 10 years. This is one of the reasons NLY's dividend has decreased in the last 10 years. Moving into 2022, NLY is at number 5 on our list because its stock prices have fallen over the last few days as soon as 2022 began. 
Even after its prices fell, it is still a healthy investment because it has great potential to outperform the market. So, rather than investing in it now, a better option would be to invest in it in the second quarter of 2022. AGNC Investment Corp. AGNC. This investment corporation is a mortgage real estate investment trust, or REIT, that invests in agency mortgage-backed securities based on leverage. Holdings are financed using borrowed money and then structured as repurchase agreements. This corporation is traded on the NASDAQ Global Select Market under the symbol of AGNC. On December 10, 2021, the company declared a common share dividend of 12 cents per month. The payable date for this dividend is January 11, 2022, to the common shareholders as of December 30, 2021. AGNC came into being due to the depreciation of American Capital's assets. American Capital defaulted its debt and began to negotiate with its creditors. Back in the third quarter of 2008, American Capital terminated its quarterly dividends and it got removed from the S&P 500 index in early 2009. AGNC works as a business unit for American Capital. It has played an important role in the growth of American Capital Management and in helping the assets of American Capital's balance sheet go higher. It offers a 9.39% forward dividend yield with a total payout ratio of 56%. The price for each dividend currently stands at $15.32 along with a one-year total return of 9.3%. The income received from these investment projects is due to the interest received on these investments. This is how the investors are paid their dividends. With risk-adjusted returns put in place, AGNC looks to take American capital into the future with stability. New Residential Investment Corp. NRZ Listed on the NASDAQ as NRZ, the New Residential Investment Corporation is a real estate investment trust. It focuses mainly on investing and managing investments related primarily to residential properties. The company was founded in 2011 and had its headquarters in New York. The company also provides capital and services to the mortgage and financial services industries. The primary goal of this company is to invest in stable assets having long-term profits. Their investment expands to loans for acquiring property, mortgage servicing, and other related assets. As of January 7, 2022, the shares of this company went 0.93% higher to $10.87. This proved to be a testing trading session for the stock market. New Residential Investment Corp. closed 94 cents below its 52-week high, $11.81, a goal which the company managed to achieve on November 3rd. Its stock managed to outperform its major competitors in the second week of January, leaving behind the New York Mortgage Trust, Namte Property, and Realty Income Corp. The trading volume, which clocked in at 3.8 million, also remained 681,137 below the 50-day average volume of 4.5 million. NRZ's forward dividend yield is currently at 9.12%, with a payout ratio of 56.4%. On the other hand, a single dividend stock price is at $10.97, offering a one-year total return of 27.6%. The market cap of NRZ is currently standing at $5.1 billion, so you can go on and buy stocks of this company this year. It would do you a whole lot of good, as it is number three on our list. Southern Copper Corp. SCCO as we discussed at the start, raw material companies are also a major player in the dividend sector. We have Southern Copper Corp at number two. It is a mining company that was founded in 1952. 88.9% of it is owned by the Mexican conglomerate Group Mexico. Southern Copper is the world's largest publicly traded copper mining company. It is also a major producer of other important minerals such as silver, zinc, lead, molybdenum, and gold. Apart from producing these materials, the company carries out mining, smelting, and refining in the facilities of Peru and Mexico while also conducting exploration in Chile. The headquarters of this company is situated in Phoenix, Arizona. The dividends yielded in a fiscal year for SECO amount to $4.97 billion, whereas the dividends paid in the last fiscal year were $1.16 billion. The forward dividend yield was at 6.72% along with a 66% payout ratio. With a $46 billion market cap and a one-year total return of 
it isn't surprising to see SCCO so high up in the list. The last payment date for SCCO was on November 23, 2021. As per analysts, the next one is expected to show up sometime in the first week of February. For SCCO, there are usually four dividend payments every year. Each of them takes place in a fiscal year's quarter. SCCO is a sensible option to consider how its performance has been steady in the last two years in terms of investment. TFS Financial Corp. TFSL TFS Financial is a stockholding company that carries out its significant activities using entirely owned subsidiaries such as mortgage lending, deposit gathering, and other financial services. Its market cap is $5 billion, and as of September 30, 2021, it has total consolidated assets of $14.1 billion. In its final quarter for the fiscal year of 2021, TFSL reported 25.3% year-over-year net income growth. The company regarded the net income growth due to the increases in net interest income and lower non-interest expense. TFSL's headquarters are based in Cleveland, Ohio, with its business expanded into other states. This savings and loan group was founded during the Great Depression in 1938, and right now it has a forward dividend yield of 6.38% and a payout ratio of 69.9%. The dividend price is $17.72, offering a 5% one-year return. Overall, it is considered a mid-sized bank and a mid-sized bank coalition of America member. This company has lent money to people to help buy homes in 25 different states. Upon the loan return, the dividends are well structured to be paid to investors. Hence, this makes the top of our dividend stocks you could buy. Investing in the stock market isn't easy, but if you make the right choices, you can definitely make a lot of money. We discussed some of the best 5 dividends you should look to buy because their trends have been quite positive. Plus, 2022 seems like a year when they will show even further growth. So, that's pretty much it for the video. Please, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and press the bell icon for more amazing content about wealth management and finance-related videos. Success is coming your way. Keep your doors open. See ya till the next time.